This exhibition is called Eden, the first glimpse of love, the first glimpse of nature, how the first human saw nature, saw animals, saw the sunrise, the first relationship between divine and man and Adam and Eve. It is he who created you from a single soul. This ayah is so powerful because it just reminds us that we're all created from one space, one soul. We always concentrate on our differences, on the gap, but we're all connected, we're all from the single soul. This time, I really want to concentrate on the first glimpse of love, really diverting from this idea of the temptation and, and the sinning and what happened. It's almost like a romance, you know, how the first moment how God created man. So Eden, it's, I think it's the place where we're all first born in and um, it just has this idea of peace and serenity. It's the initial stage, but it's also, you know, how can you find Eden here now on this earth? How can you find that glimpse of love or that glimpse of peace in the midst of this chaos? Uh, energy is everything. There's a philosophy that says um, Adam actually represents an atom. And it's again this idea of the smallest particle that creates everything. And there's a whole universe in a single atom. I don't think I actually chose the concept. I think it came to me. It's been seven years now where there's a series of um, things happening or series of emotions. And my last solo exhibition was the Garden of Isis. It was very spiritual. It was about the spirituality of the ancient Egyptians. Living with this collection for a, a year and a half or almost two years has been very soothing. Here in my studio painting, I know the canvases are alive. I know the stories on the canvases are alive. I know that every single emotion I put into um, the story is a very big part of the process. So for me, this collection or generally art is complete energy. It, it can't be anything else. And I think when people stand in front of it, they can feel it. <laughs>